Okay, just looking at some stuff online, trying to figure out what to do. Uh, the th apparently the last shard is found at Deep Folk Crossing, which is a uh, location way northeast in the Reach. Um, yeah, Deep Folk Crossing. And uh, may go ahead and try to do that even without a marker with a save first, and just in case I break anything. And... Uh, Let's see. And, uh, might try that first, and then uh, I'll go ahead and activate this so that we uh, can also do that at Wendell. Uh, but that's going to be my second choice. Oh, got to tell her we're good to go. What time is it? Uh, she apparently is not going to rely. Oh, well, I haven't purchased a bed yet. Let's go ahead and go. Guess what? The audience actually gave me some coins for my performance. Isn't that great? Do you want it? Oh no. Oh no. Keep the money. You have earned it and deserve it. Oh, how sweet of you. Yeah, well, it's not very sweet for me just to... End time. Oh, let's yes? go. Yes? We gotta go. Let's go. Sure. Yeah, let's go. Alright. Let's go try this. <laughs> Let's see, Deep Fault Crossing is clear across the map. <sighs> Way over here. Apparently it's somewhere right around here. I have no idea. Uh, somewhere here. And let's go ahead and fast travel there and then work our way eastward, see if we can find the place. Hopefully without damaging anything. Probably should have done a proper save. I will do that now. I should have done it back on the other side of the map, but oh well. Okay, let's go ahead and see if we can find this joint. Sorry. With any luck, it'll just be along the road here. Um, yeah. Let me just check out my My weapons. This will do, this will do, this will do. Let's eyeball this uh, fort slash castle, see what it, it, it is. Strange. Yeah. Sometimes I feel the same thing, Vilya. Just strange. Looking at the map. And what in the world are we doing? We're headed in the... You know, that's what I get for not examining my compass carefully. Who put that there? We want to go west. I was looking at the wrong damn marker. Oops. My bad. Look for the little green one. Head west. <sighs> yeah, that's where we want to go. All right. Oh, fun. Billy's in the mood to talk. So if she's in the mood to talk, I guess I'm in the mood to talk. Has any guy who wouldn't it be nice to just talk a little, you and I? Is in a relationship knows.
Please tell me your thoughts. Tell me honestly, do you see me as a companion? Or am I merely a sidekick to you? I'm fine with tagging along doing your things, but I do want you to respect me as a person. Oh, I do. I'm a human being, not a dog or a minion. Oh, I certainly understand that. Uh, we are a good team. And, well, let's, I'll go ahead and say you are more important to me than anyone else in Skyrim. That's what must be said. Do you really mean that? I do. Oh, you have no idea how happy this makes me. Well, I can always check and to see. To be honest, you are also more important to me than anyone else. All right. Thank you very much. Let's, uh, let's keep Shall going. Shall I continue? Yes. Enemies! You think you can beat me? Go ahead! Um... What shot do I have? I can take you. Boof! Hey! Be careful! Sorry. What's wrong with you? I'm not an enemy, you know. I know you're not an enemy. So I was just trying to be helpful. That's the best you can do. <sighs> Don't you try that. Die. Die. Oh, I missed. Don't you think so too? She already hit him. All right. Trying to get in a little, uh, little foose action there, but I'm not nearly as quick as she is. Just for fun, let's see what they got. Forsworn are usually pretty low on loot. You can get lucky and get some gems sometimes, or. Wouldn't it be nice just talking you and Maybe. Depends. It's so nice to just talk a little, you and I. I was just thinking, would you be interested if I told you a little about myself? I'd love to learn a little bit more about you, Vilya. Please, go ahead. Although I didn't find Windhelm that nice, I decided to stay for a few days. I had caught a cold on my way there and rested for a while at the inn. Mm -hmm. Strange, Elder Innkeeper doesn't seem too fond of elves, but yet she seems to get along fairly well with the Dunmabad, Ruffin. That is interesting. I hadn't noticed. I've often wondered why Luraffin is working in the Candlehawk Hall, but she could move on to a friendlier town like Whiterun. I agree. If I had been an elf living in Windhelm, I would have left the city immediately. Well... The Candlehawk Hall has good drinks, but the food... don't know. Maybe Nils should take lessons in how to add spices properly. Good point. He's always... Has Elda told you the story about how the Candle Hearth Hall got its name? If not, maybe you should ask her about it. Well, I will. Vilya is very uh, intent on making sure that the player um, pays attention to the local lore. Alright, let's go. Talk later. Let's talk later. Uh, I'm not sure whether or not I need to pick up this spot, so let's go up and give it a look. Not sure whether or not... Ooh, this may be it. This is it. This is it. Our, our, our arrow and the location pretty close. Let's take a look at the map. Yeah, it wasn't too far away. Oh my gosh. Now it's showing up. Thank goodness. Let me go ahead and get rid of this green arrow, which is easily done if you guys don't know by simply moving the pointer to an unmarked spot, clicking on it, and then and then saying remove it. Yeah. Okay. That is so nice to see that mark. Heard stories about the headless huntsman who's roaming sky at night. Scary. Isn't it? It is. That's why we have companionship, Vilya. Alright. So nice to see that marker. I don't think Ayla would train me in marksmanship again, 
Last time she did, that poor god took an arrow from me in his knee, and then he got mad at her. Oh dear. Ooh, I'm excited about this. Where is Katria? Will she show up? They say that diamonds are a girl's best friend. I understand what you mean, don't you? Um, I do. Maybe I should get her a diamond. Ah. That is so cool. Locate the Ethereum Forge. How exciting is this? We're getting so sad with all the hatred between the Force War and the rest of the sky and inhabitants. Here's Katria. Come here. Let's talk. Hmm. Beat me to it this time. Yes. That's the last one, isn't it? It's it's almost time. I'll meet you at the forge. Alrighty. Way to go. That's super. That makes me feel good. So let's see if there's a map marker now for the forge. We've got several things active. And it looks like we do have one. <coughs> no, that's Travel to Solstein. Any other map markers? Let me go ahead and remove this. And see if there are any other map markers. No. But just sort of getting in the neighborhood was enough, or maybe it was time. I have no idea, but uh, made this happen. Let's go ahead and finish this one up before we get spread too thin uh, on the other Dawn Guard quest for um, technology to improve crossbows and Dragonborn that is going to Solstein. So let's see if we can go ahead and finish this one up. Now that we have this location, I'm going to go ahead and uh, ruins of Thalft located south of Iverstead. Okay, well, let's head toward Iverstead and uh, take off from there. And hopefully a mark will show up. Rorik's dead. Oh, Iverstead. That's right over on the other side of the big mountain here. Hey, we don't know. We don't have this place marked already, probably. So, off to Iverstead. See how Temba White Arm is doing, and uh, see how our bard there is uh, also faring. Sibby Blackbriar's uh, one-time fiance, who uh, was managed, who managed to survive his attempts to have her killed by me. So. Uh, See how see how that gang's doing. Can't go to Iverstead without feeling a little guilty about assassinating um, Narfi. But oh well. And we're on the cusp of another level. I think what'll happen, I'm going to go ahead and experiment with the... Uh, with the utilitarian aspects of the legendary thing. In other words, uh, reset my smithing so that I can... so I don't have to focus so much on... Uh, on... Um, Never bothering with any perks. At least the weather is nice, and that's a good start, isn't it? An alteration and uh, illusion, those. It is a good start. Okay, where we're we? we're supposed to head south, right? Your armor made of dragon scales. My God, so that wouldn't do for a set of that. Yeah. Hey, let's go ahead and stay here for a little bit. I don't think Vilia's slept in a long, long time. Let's see if this. Getting a bed here will allow her to sleep, or if she needs to, just go ahead and throw down her. Welcome to the Villamir Inn. If there's anything I can get you, just let me know. You betcha. Now that our ghost has been unmasked, I hope we see more visitors in town than just the occasional pilgrim. As do I, Wilhelm. 
Sure thing. It's yours for a day. All right. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Okay, we'll have Vilya relax in here, see whether or not she will take advantage of this this bed. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Or this bed. That's owned. This is this is mine. I think I if think it's mine she may not yes? use it. Um well, first of all I'm gonna offer her a drink. Oh how sweet of you. And uh I have ale for you. Oh, I like that. Give it to me, please. There's nothing like a good drink when one is thirsty. Oh, I agree. Ah, oh, this is so relaxing. I have my coffee in the other room, as a matter of fact. Thank I you. I need to fetch it. Okay, and... Uh, I always liked rural inns. They're so cozy. They are, aren't they? Uh, Oblivion, Villa, Oblivion Villa also likes uh, rural inns very, very much. She'll stay at the more homey one as opposed to the ostentatious place sometimes if she's got a choice. All right, would you like to relax? Good idea. Okay, and that means she may go ahead and not use the bed. I thought she was going to for just a minute. Yeah, she's going to hang out. Hey, uh... You know, friend, I like being together with you. Well, I like being together with you, too. Let's go uh, about this place. Yes. Um, we'll spend the night here. All right. So you'll have to use your bedroll. If you say so. Uh, I would prefer you to... Uh, that perfect. Look at that. All right. Apparently she's going to sleep in her armor because I told her to wear it, so... Just catch a little bit of uh, rest there. As will I. Then we'll wake up and then go look for uh, the spot that we're supposed to get. All right. Catch up real quick with. Uh, a fine day to you, friend. No. May you die with a sword in your hands. Oh, yes. Pardon me, my lord. Would you care to hear me play my lute? Uh, nah, that we're okay. A pleasant journey, my lord. Right back at you. Do you think you can sit down in front of the fire for a while? Honey, you just slept all night long. We're okay. Let's go ahead and go. Oh, how sweet of you. Oh, no. Uh, okay. I have wine for you. I didn't mean to give her a drink. Oh, I like that. Don't want to get her, uh... I don't want to get her soused That's before not we head a out. Good drink or one is thirsty. Yeah, I apologize. I clicked on the ah, wrong thing, but this is so relaxing. Okay, now let's. Uh, no, 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 no! Don't go back to bed, will you? Uh, I know you're sleepy. A little bit of a wine buzz. We'll do that sometimes. What's on your mind, friend? Hey, uh, let's uh, go have some adventures. Of course. All right, and she picks up her bedroll, and we're off. <clears throat> Miss Temba is much happier now that you took care of those bears. She may not look like she is, but I can oh. tell. Thank you. That's nice to hear because she does not look like she is happier. She just looks unimpressed with my efforts. All right. The sun will come up shortly, and we're supposed to head south. And uh, so that's what we're going to do. We'll find our way. I'm a bit thirsty. I wouldn't mind a drink. Yeah, you don't have to give her a drink every time she says that because sometimes she's just making conversation. But for crying out loud, I boozed her up right at uh, right when I woke her up. All right. Looking around. Uh, Wouldn't it be nice to just talk a little, you and I? Maybe. Wouldn't it be nice to just talk a little, you and I? Okay. I wish you would look after your armor a bit more often. I don't want to nag, but it scares me when you're not well protected. Well, thank you for your concern, Vilya. End time. 
All right, let's go. <sighs> Torn between this little shack. Maybe we ought to just get both of them on the map. Kind of keep both of them in the radar here. If it looks like one is... Well, hang on a second. Let's get this... Yeah, that was a dumb thing. I should get a... Let's take a look. I need a... Let's go ahead and throw up the fireballs. Because I am interested in... Uh, or fire bolts. I am interested in having... We'll, we'll get to that second here. Yeah, we're close enough to get it on the map. Ah! I always think I'm just being infected with cave bear diseases. Ah, you big bear. See those little bubbles of bear infection entering my bloodstream. Yeah. Bone break fever. Whatever. I've got a lot of potions of cure disease. Cure all diseases. Strange. Yeah. Ah, the sun's up. Feels good. Starting to warm up. Limbs are getting loosened. And... What is this strange little place? Strange. Oh yeah, Alchemist Shack. I love the serenity of this place. Yeah, me too. Can't remember if the bed is unowned or not. Everything you could need to make poisons and uh, so stuff. So many things to do. So little time. Why isn't that the truth? Read the Alchemist Journal. Yes, brilliant decision, beautiful plants. Yeah. This really is a gorgeous location. Oh, 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 I meant to... Didn't mean to take the journal. Here, let's, uh... I like Iverstead. It's so pretty with the water and all the birches. It is. Iverstead is a beautiful little town. Beautiful little town at the foot of... A very important mountain. All right, great little shack. I remember coming here several times in uh, in one playthrough when I stumbled across this relatively early in the game. I actually used that facility, that uh, alchemy table, to make some stuff when I didn't really know what I was doing. It was it was fun though. More memories. Slept in the bed. So many things yet to explore in this playthrough around here. All right. Let's go over here. And if this isn't uh, it, then we'll go ahead and... How many dragons have you killed by now? Who knows? It must be at least 50. Honestly, don't you find it big? Okay, a little bit of a conflict going on here. And this will be one where I end up using my magic before I... Let me go ahead and throw on the amulet that of uh, R.K. Rakatosh. For a little bit quicker magic or regeneration. Okay, didn't know if it was a bandit or a hunter. 
a blood horker. You think you can beat me? Go ahead. Simon Guard awaits. Probably stuff on a lot of these people, but the loot's probably not so terribly important that I'm going to hunt down everybody. Let's take a look at this. Brandy and Cumberry wine. Here we go. Not Ruins of Falft. Ah, and the marker shows up. Just as we would have hoped. Okay, I'm not sure why it didn't show up before. I, all I care is that it has shown up. And let's talk with Catria. You made it. And you brought the shards. Yep. Yes, I have them. What now? Look at the device here. The gear in the center is just about the right size. Try putting the shards in and we'll see what happens. Okay. Let's go do it. <coughs> Why? It is just about the right size. I think I need to back up just a little bit here. Try taking it out. Okay. Ooh. What the? Get back. Hurry. Yeah, get back, Vilya. Come here. Vilya. Get back. Now that is pretty cool. It's, it's true. It's all true. Come on, let's check it out. Let's. I'm excited about this. Find the Ethereum Forge. Get Villian here, Katria in here, and let's head on down. Okay. That took longer than usual. How deep are we? We're really deep. I mean like deep delicious deep. Here we go. Well, I think I'm gonna get out. And that'll be good. Do you know the name of this ruin? Uh, yes, I do. I can't pronounce it. It's the Ruin of Bthalft or something. Let's take a look. Wouldn't it be nice to just talk a little, you and I? <sighs> yeah, Katria has all the time in the world because she's a ghost, so tell me your thoughts. Have you got many ingredients in store? If not, maybe we could just go and pick some nice flowers. It's been a lot of fighting lately, hasn't it? I would love to go pick some flowers with you on a nice sunny day. Let's keep going. Anytime. All right. Ooh, I like how the lights come on. Like a uh, motion detector. I think I like how the lights come on. Very, very nice interior. You know, I've had some glitchy problems with some of the uh, Dawn Guard stuff, but can't complain about the effort put into the interior design, at least. In many ways, I'm glad that you are a warrior. No one's Magic might be good, but I don't quite understand what a spell can do better than a maze. What is it? What do you make of all this? I can hardly believe it. This is it. We've actually found the forge. At last. 
and uh, okay I'll ask you that one later if it's still around because it seems like a version of the same question stuff Dwemer bits and pieces and beautiful Dwemer architecture looks like Markarth doesn't it <gasps> ooh I like that I have seen one of those before and I don't care if I never see one again now you sound a little bit against Dwemer architecture and I'm going to have to convert you to the joys of Weimar architecture. Very pretty. Alright, our arrow is pointing us ever upward. Let's look around. The, uh, the tree in the center motif. Something we see in Skyrim and uh, Lord of the Rings and other stories. Ma my feet are killing me. Let's get Mage Light on. Feet are killing me. Door shut tight. I bet those resonators would open it, though. Probably so. Just looking around. <clears throat> All right, what resonators? <clears throat> pardon me, I'm losing my voice. What resonators are we talking about? I don't see. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Hi. Hi. Trying to get these resonators to go. All right. Got to love those Dwemer resonators. I will feel a little bit better if I can have another. Fighting tool at my hand. It feels different. Almost like. Almost like what? This would be a good time to. What is it? What do you think of this place? It feels old, doesn't it? Even by dwarven standards, no one has been here in thousands of years. I think you're probably right. All right, I'll go ahead. <clears throat> I do have a lot of. <coughs> Pardon me, I do have a lot of help here, so I'm going to go ahead and go with double firebolt. So there's an arrow pointing at it. All right, let's shut down the steam. Turn, 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 turn. Ooh. Um, while we're here, let's run up, take a peek. Okay, not a door. And let's run over the other side. And just for fun, shut off the steam, do a quick save right before. All right. Yes. 
Steam is off. Damn, what the What the what? Spiders. Alright, we can handle this. Come on. Alright. I agree, you are not bad. Out of magic. So I think at this point it's going to have to go to conventional weapons. Dead and standing up. What now? Well, what's happening now is that I really need to take just a second to, uh... Oh, God. Oh, this is nice. Now, this is where we'll go ahead and get out our Dramora Lord. Uh... I better get the conjure bow. He's not going to last very long against this guy. We must. This is the real Ethereum Forge. I agree. Your thesis is sound. By forging something, of course. <sighs> Go ahead. After everything you've done, you should do the honors. Thank you. Um, with what? There isn't any Ethereum here, is there? Damn it. Wait. Yes. Yes, there is. The shards we collected. They're pure Ethereum. Remember? I like the shards. It's not much. All right. But it'll do. We can use them. With them and the materials in this room, we should have everything we need. Okay. Um, do you think there's more Ethereum somewhere? I don't know. I honestly don't know. After all these years, it's a miracle even this much survived. Make it count. This may be the only chance we ever get to use the forge. I agree. <sighs> Is there anything here? Patrick Arrows. Flawless Garnet. Grand Soul Gem. Ruby Sapphire. Wow. Juicy. Look at this. Look at this. What a marvelous construction. Let's go do this for continuity, for the story, for immersion. Then I gotta go back there and search those sphere remnants. <sighs> Alright. Two dwarven metal ingots, two gold ingots. 
Let's go find the two dwarven metal ingots, two gold ingots. Let's poke around. License to examine the floor. Hmm. Probably nothing. Probably something. Alright, let's check this out. Oops. Yeah, there have got to be things in this room that we can use. If not, then we'll just fast travel, go pick it up, and do it. Love the bolts. Don't love that. Wow, lots of goodies here. It's probably the same one. Yep, and... You know, I've never really known... I don't know I've used the Dwarven Oil much. I've got some that I collected. And... Alright, so... If we work under the assumption that there's... Stuff. Oh, pff, duh. Take a look at the arrow, and dwarven metal ingot. Dwarven metal ingot. All right. And bang! There's everything we want. Some good stuff. I could have just gotten pick up everything, but it's more fun to sometimes paw it with my hands. <sighs> Run it through my fingers, roll around naked on top of it, and uh, then slowly add it to the stuff. Alright. Ethereum Forge, what do I want? I can have a crown. Retains the last standing stone ability you held, granting you its effects in addition to those of I your can't current. I wait to get out of this place. I know. We're, if we're, we survive, that is. We're going to survive. We've already... You've already gone toe-to-toe -to -toe with the monster and survived. Um, ethereal crown. Okay. This would make it so I can't wear a uh, helmet, though. So, I don't know. We'll see. Enemies struck by this shield become ethereal for 15 seconds, making them unable to attack or be attacked. So, it's a nice stalling technique. It's heavy armor. Mm, not my first choice. Summon a the dwarven spider or sphere for 60 friend. seconds, wherever the caster opinion, is pointing. I think this is what I want. Crown. Having two standing stone abilities is attractive, but having to wear that instead of something else, maybe not. Value-wise, this is supposed to be the most valuable, but I think for me, for my character, this might be I the most... This might be the most valuable... You, yes, they have, Vilya. Hang on just a second, we're almost done. I think I'm gonna make this. I'm not lured by the... just the value aspect of it. It's a one-time thing, isn't it? Alright, let's do it. I do. Okay, let's go talk to Katria. She'll probably want to see this. That staff, it's everything I could have hoped for. Oh, I wish I could give it to you. I really do. That, it's done. No one could possibly deny what we found now. I agree. What now? For me, I've done what I set out to do. But you... Take that out into the world, and if anyone asks, tell them what we discovered, together. You bet your sweet ethereal butt I will. Is there any more ethereum? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Alright. After all these years, Same answer. it's a miracle even this much survived. I'm sorry, I asked you already once. And, uh, finally, 
Congratulations, Cantria. You have been vindicated, and, uh, and the world will know that it was you because of me. And thank you. I've waited so long for this moment. We found it at last. And now, I think I can rest. Farewell, my friend. Wherever your travels take you. Yeah, farewell, Katria. Probably nothing. Oof. She's gone. A vapor. Hey, look at that. We got an achievement. All right. All right, my dear. We're out of here. We've uh, done what we came to do. Wow. Really quite a thing. A sea of lava surrounds it. Amazing. Really quite stunning. Look at that. Heat shimmering. There's someone watching me. I can tell. All right, we totally need to get out of here. She's gonna, she's gonna have a sort of one of those claustrophobic moments that that a Nord would have in an enclosed Dwemer space. And uh, let's get out of here and see the world. Just was there another easier way out? I don't think there was. Okay, let's go. I think this is the only way out. I wonder if we were to fall into that water where we'd end up going. We better look out for spear constructs. They can appear anywhere. My heart, they are absolutely I know. Yeah, let's go outside. Yeah, everything will be better when we get outside. Yeah, everything will be better. Mm. Well, it's nice to have that done. And uh, having completed that, now we can focus on some of the other stuff, uh, including uh, learning more about how to make crossbows for the Dawn Guard faction and me. And, uh, and since that's going to require going to Solstheim, then I guess because that's where Rodolf's house is, I had to look it up because I wasn't getting a quest marker. Um, I think we're going to go ahead and visit Solstheim for the first time in this game. Uh, that will be a, another recording, though. Thank you for watching.